Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Nicole and today we're going to do the fourth cash envelope stuffing of May. So as always, I just want to start by emptying out the coins that I've gathered. Lately, for some reason, I've been getting a lot of coins. It's probably because I've been spending a lot of money. Um, but it's fine. Everything's fine. Quarantine's got me so bored. All I do is spend money and it's so bad. So I zoomed you guys in so you can see better. But um, this week I got paid $286. And this was from DoorDash. Originally, I thought I was going to get unemployment. And then since I started doing DoorDash, they kind of said like, even though all the other weeks I wasn't working, they said like fill out this form and then they sent me another email and they said it would take a month to review the form. So I've kind of just given up on that and I'm just gonna like just do DoorDash and just hope for the best. But if I end up getting it from the weeks of work that I did miss, um, that would obviously be great. But I don't want to get my hopes up or spend so much money that I can't like, you know, pay back or whatever. So I'm just sticking to my original plan of just like budgeting like normal and just not expecting any extra income. Um, but like DoorDash, honestly, I have been making a lot more money than I usually make at my regular job anyway. So it's been nice. Um, hopefully soon I can go back to my regular job and do both DoorDash and my part-time job. That way I'll have even more income. Um, but without further ado, let's get started. So, speaking of spending money, um, let's go over my Discover card. So, I'm just going to write Discover here. And that balance is $254. So, I guess since we're in quarantine, I've just been spending a lot of money mindlessly. And I really got to work on that. Um, I might do a video soon about, like, what I spend in a week. Just so you guys can get an idea of, like, what I mean. Like, when I'm in quarantine, like, all the unnecessary stuff. Like, I bought a bunch of clothes, like... I bought food, like takeout and stuff like that, um, but I'm definitely going to need to start working on that uh, because I do want to keep my balance low. I mean, this is relatively low, like it's not anything crazy that I can't pay off, but I don't want to just carry a balance all the time because that was the original goal of like why I started budgeting. Um, so this week I'm going to pay $61 towards it. Kind of jumped ahead, so <laughs> this is due. Um, June 18th, 2020, with a minimum payment, as usual, of 35 The next card is my Torrid card, and this is, like, the clothes that I've been buying or whatever. And, um, this has a balance of 75 67 So, with the 75 67 I can't pay anything towards it because it hasn't processed yet. They said they bill you when they ship it, and they haven't shipped it, and it's been a while but I'm thinking like they might be like backed up or closed or whatever just because of anything that's going on which is fine but that just means I can't pay anything towards it right now so that's why I'm not paying anything towards it this week um I did have a payment that was due June 1st um and that was just like the $17 from that was left over on that card so this next one I'm assuming is going to be due July 1st of 2020 uh, so I do have quite a bit of time. The amount that's going to be due is 35 and the amount I'm paying this week is nothing. Sorry if I've been rambling a lot. I just, like, I had a lot to, like, catch up on. Um, but my first ca uh, cash envelope is spending. And this week, since I have been spending a lot and a lot has been going on my card, I decided to put 60 in there. So hopefully I can just use the $60 and not go over. And I know that there's nothing in there, so the total is going to be $60. And for my cash envelopes, the first one I have is Beauty. And this is going to be getting $10 for today. And I'll come back and write the total amount. I don't really have a goal yet for Beauty. It just depends on what my nails will end up costing me once I am able to get them done. And also, like, if I have a specific thing that I want makeup-wise or, like, uh, face wash-wise, then I'll plan and save for that. So there's not really any goal. The next one is car maintenance. And car maintenance is going to get $20 this week. Again, with this, I don't really have a set goal. It's just kind of like I want this one to be 
like a beefier uh, sinking fund so whatever I can add that's like more than the other ones is what I plan on doing. The next fund I have is gifts and this week I'm putting $31 towards it and the reason I did 31 is because I bought my sister a gift um, on my credit card and I just needed to make up the difference of what's already in there and then I'm going to deposit that into the bank which you'll see later. My last sinking fund is miscellaneous and miscellaneous is getting $30 this week and I believe there's nothing in it so the total is only going to be 30 Next is my savings and this week I chose to put in $17 and for my taxes I always do 20% so 20% of 286 is about $57 and all my taxes I just leave in my bank account. Alright so now let's go ahead and get the cash out and actually it's definitely envelopes. So I'm just going to start with spending, and spending is getting $60, so I'm just going to do all 20s. So 20, 40, 60, 60. And the next one I'm going to do is beauty, and beauty is getting $10 this week. So there is 20, 30, 35 in there. And then I'm going to do car maintenance and car maintenance is going to get $20 today. So there is $70 in car maintenance. Like I said before, I popped a tire and I had to put that expense on my credit card because I stopped doing sinking funds for a little bit, um, but that's why I really wanted to get back into it. Um, so next time that happens, I'll actually have money for it. <laughs> um, next is um, gift slash Christmas, and this is getting $31, so do 31 and I think there should be 56 if I'm not mistaken. So 20, 40, 55, 56. So I just changed the envelope for miscellaneous uh, because the other one was like a little tight and it was hard to put the money in the envelope. Uh, but this is getting $30 and there's nothing in it currently. Now I'm going to do the money that I need to take to the bank, which is 61 plus 57, which is 118. And I'm just going to go ahead and put that in my two bank envelopes. So let's get it. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and 5, 10, 15. 16, 17, 18. So again, just to double check, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 105, 110, 115, 116, 117, 118. And that's going to go in this, oh, there's many in here. Um, I don't really, I don't really know what this is from, but I'm just going to add it and put more towards my Discover. I like remember putting it in here last week, but I don't know why, probably for my bills. So we're just gonna go with that. I it's 150 in here now, so I'll just put the extra towards my Discover card and call it a day. <laughs> I really can't figure out why it was in here, um, but we'll put it to good use. So the last thing I like to do is pick a number and color it in. This week I chose 17, so I'm going to go ahead and color it in. Next week I'm going to pick a number over here because this, this row is a little lonely, man. 
But anyway, let's just make sure this is $17. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay, it's perfect. Always, I'm going to roll up the money. The ones I'm not going to do individually just because that would take way too long. But all the other ones I am. So, put that in there. And... always struggle. <laughs> I don't know why. Alright. It kills me to roll up these new bills. Okay. And there's one more five. Alright. It's getting full. There's mainly low bills in there. There's nothing really that big in there. But it's exciting to see how full it's getting. And last thing I want to do before we do the total amounts is just take out my gift money and add it to this because I'm depositing it so that I can pay my bill. So I will take this to the bank tomorrow. So for my total amounts, Beauty has a total of 35 in it right now. Car maintenance has a total of 70. And Gifts has a total of 56. However, I am depositing that into the bank because it is already spent money. Um, so that's all for today's video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing. As always, I hope you guys are doing well, and I will see you guys next week.